Hi dear Espresso TV watchers, uh, let's be back again with a small tour of the Quick Mill machines. Here we have the Quick Mill Vetrano. It's equipped with a rotary pump, so a big motor pump, and uh, as well as a water tank with uh, yeah, both possibilities. Either tank connection here as well as a main water connection here and you have a switch just to turn between Tanika, this means tank and Rete, Rete means main water so you just have to switch and the connection of the main water you found down here at the bottom here is the uh, connection to the main water so that's just some basic instruction uh, otherwise the machine is manufactured uh, very well as well as the smaller one, the Aquila, it is with a vibration pump and only tank connection but uh, so you will hear the difference especially in the sound with the vibration pump here and the rotary pump here rotary pump is uh, less noisy than a vibration pump and here we have a very small grinder of quick mill, this is the Apollo and the real professional grinder, this is the Mazza Super Jolly Electronic. So now let's start a little bit with the test. Let's see what we get out of the machines. First we dry the filter holders because the water has to be get out of it and uh, so I'm just using the Super Jolly Electronic. Here you can see this one, it sounds totally different. Here I'll make a little bit more. If you mind about the dirt, well it's a good argument to have always a kind of brush here besides uh, the grinder so you can remove this stuff uh, quite easily and uh, yeah that's the way to operate with uh, such semi-automatic machines the degree of coffee powder you always see uh, is uh, quite similar you fill it uh, completely and then you tamp it You see the powder on the side uh, moves inside when you knock a little bit on the side. So, but there are also some specialists who use this tamper and then they turn like this, but this is more like a show because it doesn't change anything. But it's totally up to you. And so I prepare everything. And we start here with the espresso with the small vibration pump. Result is quite good. And then we use the cappuccino cups. Uh, it's a little bit too coarse, but it's okay. Uh, um, yeah, I'm not quite happy, but it's okay. There are much uh, worse results possible. So now we try the rotary pump. Yeah, it's also quite okay. Looks good. Quite attractive. Always remove the condensed water before you steam, so I try this one. Yeah, now you can hold. Just like this, and uh, when it starts getting hot, then you have to do something, just stop the steam. Okay, the bubbles are a bit big, are a bit big, but... Uh, I think I can manage it. So here you see that it, the milk turns a little bit around and this is quite important to get not uh, too much foam. Otherwise it's uh, not a real cappuccino, but it uh, doesn't matter. 
Uh, anyway, we get some uh, strange result because it's quite hot here, so uh, I'm sweating like crazy, you know. Uh, sometimes, yeah, this has nothing to do with nervousness. It's only very humid here and uh, very south of Germany and uh, let's see what's going on. Yep, this is kind of a hard. And uh, let's see whether we get something else. So it's still not perfect. I'm not quite happy, but for the beginning, I think it's uh, it's okay. Yeah, something like this, a flower or whatever, some fantasy product. Yeah, here also a little bit uh, something for fantastic. And now let's have a test of the coffee. Uh, I used here a Café Cagliari from Modena. We well, also Ferrari Maserati are at home, so yeah, that's a real Italian taste. Uh, yeah, wow, especially on the floor. No? Mm, excellent, real excellent. So I think the finishing of the machines are really well done. And uh, yeah, I'm quite happy with the quality. Also here one feature I forgot is the trip ray. It's really brilliant, solved brilliant here uh, when you connect it to the main water here you see the screw, just unscrew it and yeah, maybe we see something or maybe not, yeah. Okay, so every detail is solved uh, quite perfectly, so I'm happy with uh, quick new products. Yeah, yeah, I would say uh, nearly state of the art, cool products, okay, ciao.